I should download it right now, but I'm commentating, so I'll do it later. But either way, we're getting into grand finals, Dara. We're out here. We had 200 and something people mm -hmm. in this bracket, 200, 221, all leading up to this grand finals right here. We got Chunky Kong. We got Jake. We got Donkey Kong. We got Steve. So, oh, we don't have Steve. We have Alex. You corrected me on that before, so I'm I'm here to return the favor, my friend. So Donkey Kong and Alex. Again, I feel like all of these matchups on paper for Donkey Kong just seem like he's gonna have a tough time. But Chunky Kong has already beaten everybody that I said the same exact thing about before. Oh, yeah. So uh, who knows? Maybe I'm. Maybe that's just completely irrelevant, and Chunky Kong can make anything he wants to happen. He has been beating the odds all day as well. Beat Zane, beat WebJP, beat mm -hmm. Sem, beat BMM 40, 40, 40. All these fantastic players. Chunky Kong did it all with Donkey Kong. And he's doing it big wow. with Donkey Kong right now. Taking out, <laughs> Alex is gone. It's Dash Attack for you. It's Minecraft the classic. Minecraft is canceled. <laughs> no more Minecraft. <laughs> um. So great now, Jake. Really gonna be trying to find this ledge trap. I like the attempt to go for the up like that to get quickly back onto the stage. Uh, Jake might be able to find like a ledge jump back from that position, but right now, Chunky Kong. Ooh. Ooh. That's quick. That's quick thinking by Jake right there to let that anvil off. And he had the iron to do it because he spent so much time mining. Oh that the eye on, on the down air could have definitely been a little bit tighter as well, but it's also kind of in the heat at the moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jake, how are they going to get back onto the stage? Ooh. They are not. Good Chunky edgeguard. Kong. And it is not often that you actually get those kinds of edgeguards on Steve. No way. That's really impressive from Chunky Kong. Just occupied that space so well. Oh, my. Oh, no. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh, my God. I thought he was about to do a much different combo. <laughs> I was what is happening? A completely different combo to what I was thinking of. Chunky Kong do not care. It's been a minute and a half. Chunky Kong do not care about Steve. DLC? Cool. Big Monkey. Big Monkey hit strong. Me hit strong gooder than you. That was insane. Chunky's advantage there was great. Not letting Jake have any breathing room whatsoever. Using back air to trade with side B there? Yeah. That was perfect. And Donkey, Donkey Kong has a nice. good back air. Donkey Kong has a good back air, but a really, nice one. That's uh, Donkey <laughs> Kong just played that matchup impeccably. Really, that is the biggest moment of. That is what makes who breaks Steve. At the end of the day, it is, can I side B to get back onto the stage? If I can, you either A completely not putting me in disadvantage and letting me get back on, or B even worse, you're getting hit by it. The counter play is to be able to intercept side B, to be able to get into the startup, to be able to occupy that space. And Chunky Kong had such a good understanding of, hey, this is where Steve wants to be side B. <gasps> oh no. No. What? Okay. It is town. Town has the highest ceiling now after the travesty that was Smash 4 town. Interesting. Anyway. <laughs> Neither that up here, nor did the F smash are gonna kill, but not really sure what button that was. I do believe that was a neutral. Once again, Chunky Kong has just been using that so often uh, to be able to intercept these upbeats from Jake. It's either those high catches with back here or dropping with Nell. <gasps> <laughs> if you are meta view, you're gonna be seeing that tomorrow. You're gonna be seeing that real soon. Oh my god, Chunky Kong is going insane! Who let this <laughs> monkey out of the zoo? He's going kind of bananas good about now. Chunky is going off, my friend. I reverted to Ape as a commentator. Right now because neutral of this game. He's dead. <gasps> Yeet! Oh my god! This is gonna be the <laughs> My brain is broken! That was oh a minute ten. God. That was a minute ten seconds, man. He's going ham. What DLC character? What invalidating combos? What disadvantage? Tomahawk I'm a big strong neutral monkey. B? Who does Tomahawk oh. neutral be? Who does the empty hop in place? And then does a B reverse neutral be? Oh my god. And Town allowed Chunky to kill a lot quicker. I mean, he yeah. brought him all the way to the edge of the blast zone. So that I could do, have happened I, on any stage, but still. I, I, I do believe the TNC blast zones are a little bit shorter at the sides, though, right? So <laughs> they're a little bit. to wake up. 
Wake up, Jake. <laughs> it's more. Get your coffee, bro. You're down 2 0 in grands. <laughs> Chucky's about to take the tournament. He's just, he's just been catching Jake off guard every single time with these giant explosive options. How is Chucky Kong this good, man? I'm just, I'm just like thinking about it. Like Chucky Kong just has such a good handle on this matchup. Oh, that no tomahawk way. grab, this conditioning from Chunky Kong is just coming into fruition right about now. That positioning and awareness from Chunky Kong, never over committing. That's it. That's that it. That's up. the tournament, baby. That's over. GGS. Shake my hand. We're ending before midnight. Chunky Kong, JV fours Jake to end this oh, tournament. Wait. Your Get Club 15 champion is Chunky Kong. Dara, what did we just watch? What did we just watch? I am speechless. I'm about to put my tie on and pretend I'm Donkey Kong after that one. That was insane. Um, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. The, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Can I see um, Monkey in chat, please? Can I just, just post Monkey. Monkey. Just specifically, monkey. specifically, hold on, hold on. I'm going to type it out for y'all. Chunky that, W. Can we see some Monkey in monkey. chat? Oh, okay. oh God! So let's talk about that for a second while we're still on air, because uh, there's definitely a good little chunk of analysis to be had. I feel pretty good about that. Um, I think what really made that set for Chunky Kong was, aside from the fact that their advantage state was just solid, tight, and clean, the biggest thing was the positioning at the edge of the stage. Chunky Kong understood all of Jake's recovery mix-ups in the set. There are two things happening. One, I'm going to up B at mid-range and go directly to the ledge. Two, I'm going to use minecart as a way to go high. Chunky Kong did a really good job of dropping down, tracking Jake, and then being able to understand what is the next recovery option that is happening. Baited out the mid recovery. All right, well, it's going to be the new trailer that takes that stock. Baited out that high recovery, it's going to be a back to do it. And listen, if, if it's not going to be the edge guards, Chunky Kong's advantage state is absurd. You know, he's, he's just able to put on unspeakable amounts of damage. He's able to make it all guaranteed. He's able to tech chase. He's able to position himself, cover all of Steve's options. That was brutal. That was menacing. Chunky Kong did an amazing, amazing job so that means everybody chunky kong is gonna be your get clipped number 15 champion jake gonna be taking it with a not so close second place and coming in third bmm uh yeah for the full top eight here we've got uh sam gonna be taking fourth uh after dqing uh kage x ice and uh, and uh mando gonna be taking fifth place we've also got elijahman and slurp mm -hmm. taking a hot seventh this tournament as well i wanted to see the set record between chunky kong and jake uh because i was super duper curious to see um how much they played because it looked like, the way chunky kong played it looked like they played eternally unfortunately smash data is not working which sucks um, yeah, we can always check that out at a later date. But gamers, that is going to conclude yeah. Get Clipped number 15. But before we do sign off for today, gamers, this production, everything that is happening right now is all being powered by MetaView. And MetaView, right now, it's available on iOS. It's available new on, on Android. Android. Yeah, for the first time ever. So anybody with access to the Google Play Store, go and do yourselves a favor. Go ahead and download this incredible, incredible app. Excuse me. Uh, it's got amazing content. Uh, look at that. That's an Android user right there, able to download it from the Google Play Store. Um, you got so many amazing content creators putting out uh, just in clips, all the highlights onto the app constantly. Every single Tuesday, that's 20 clips. Every single Friday, that's another 10 clips. Um, so while we do sign off for tonight, I just want to give a quick little shout out. <laughs> Uh, as a, I wanted to give uh, Devin one more quick little shout out. Shout outs to House of 3000, who being able to put on an amazing production, has been holding it down in Tri-State and New York for the longest time. If you're not following them on Twitter, Facebook, Twitch, and YouTube, keeping up with the latest content, you are doing yourself a disservice. Top of the line production, amazing players from the Tri-State area and beyond. Um, so every single Wednesday, guys, is the Xeno Offline Weekly, starting from 7 p.m. If Yay. you're in the area, go ahead and check it out. Do the amazing thing. <laughs> what is it? What is it, Devin? We need the yay. Devin, do the yay. Yay! Yay! yay. Zeno! Woo!
<laughs> it's it's the Premier League tournament. This is the one that everybody talks about. This is the one with all the amazing players. You should go ahead and check it out. You should go ahead and attend it. You should go ahead and listen to us commentate it as well because we are New York natives ourselves. But before we do sign off for today, my little pog champs, that's you. I got to talk about my lovely, incredible co-caster, Fang. You can follow him at Fan9S. Sean's doing so, so much for the community as well. Editing for some of your favorite top players like Goblin, like Tarek, like Beast. Putting out so much incredible content and really, really helping them out. So if you're ever in need of any editing for your own content, uh, you know, you should you should go ahead and hit him up. Hit because I got the cheapest rates in the business right now. Mm -hmm. I wish I was lying. <laughs> wish I was lying. <laughs> hey, that'd be cool. And then additionally... Anyway. Hold on. There's a, another co-caster uh, right there. It's Dara. Dara, one of the also hardest working people in Smash right now as well, commentating everything she can get her, her little fingies on. Uh, Dude, she's little. also a fantastic content creator. I don't know if you've been streaming as much lately, but Dara has a stream. You can follow her at twitch.tv slash Daramgaria. You can also mm -hmm. find her on Twitter at Duram Gari on Twitter, where she posts mm -hmm. some of the most thought-provoking, insightful tweets I have ever seen uh, this side of the Hudson River. And uh, yeah, that is going to be it here today for us at Get Clipped. I hope you guys drink water. Hope you can get to bed early because it is the summer, so you mm -hmm. want to enjoy each and every day of it. Uh, make sure you give your mom a hug. 